Hello and welcome. You have arrived at RolandBarkley.com and this is the section of the inescapable nemesis. Ah, the inescapable nemesis. As a highly creative person, whether it be scientist, a great architect, a master musician, a highly powerful actor in whatever area you put out a huge amount of effort to break through as a creative genius. It's almost as if something wakes up. Well, that's because when a highly creative person brings up a lot more energy than he's ever faced before, something does in fact wake up. I have researched what that is, I have researched what to do about it, I have researched how to write it, I have researched how to harness it and use it instead of it being your enemy. You have come to the place where I can work with you in a short number of hours and the hugest barriers that ever got in the way and made your life terrible and miserable as a highly creative person in a short number of hours that barrier will be gone and turned into a volcanic force of energy you will use to focus to make your life's work happen it's the nemesis, it's inescapable, and you can use it as a force to power up your work to guarantee your success. You have arrived at RolandBarkley.com, the inescapable nemesis. Is it good? Is it evil? All the millions of things you have asked when you have wondered why it seems like something's stopping you. Every time you succeed, something crashes you down, and then you get up and you keep going. What is it? We have researched what it is, how to use it. Welcome, should you decide to let go of the suffering and instead use it in your creative work.